The Lean Longboard incorporates innovation and advancement in longboard technology. Now this board gives you three main things. Great stability, great power control, and responsiveness to the rider. The Lean Board really leans into its turns. I wanted a board which is like perfect for cruising and carving. And I noticed if I have a big wheels on it, I can go over any cracks and it's smooth. I put big wheels on my regular board. And it didn't really work that well. It would like raise up the center of gravity, which go high up the ground. So being a passionate skateboarder and uh, as well as an engineer, I thought like, why can't I make something my own? So I'm calling it lean because the way the lean steering works is like as an individual axle for each wheel. These wheels are perfect for all terrain because you want to be able to glide over those obstacles like small rocks or large cracks that can make you break suddenly or just throw you off your groove. The Lean Longboard is spring-loaded and this gives you a constant force. And if you prefer more carvability, you can actually loosen the springs. And if you prefer higher speed, what's cool is you can actually tighten the springs. Longboards don't really turn as much as this, and I like it because, like, when it turns, it's like really smooth. It's something different, you know. Like, and and for that, I, I had a blast just cruising up and down here real quick. I mean, I like it. I could actually think of a few friends who would be interested in something like that. That's more their style. The shape of the lean board is actually symmetrical. So it can move in either direction and it's perfect for free lighting. It curves up, which gives you pockets, holding and locking your feet in, giving you more control and more of a sense of confidence when making those sharp turns. add a little kick on to this side of the board. And pretty much what that does is it gives you an extra grip for your feet so when you're sliding down the hill, you know, you have something somewhere to place your feet so you feel safe and you feel secure. And you just, you get a whole different experience riding. It's almost like falling in love for the first time. Yeah. As you can see from our last camp and we, we, were, we came very close and we missed it by 20%. We don't consider that as a failure because people still in today's day, they still contact us. We already reached up to 80%, why not complete it to 100%? If you raise enough money off the Kickstarter, you can actually afford to do mass production. Yeah. Then it could be a lot cheaper. We need your help on Kickstarter to help make this all possible. You know, we have a cool design. We want to get it out there. Like us on Facebook, you know, follow us on Instagram. We are Pramash. Let's leave. Yeah, let's leave. We love skateboards, especially the good old-fashioned ones. But here's the thing, they're faulty. 
just at the very basic level, the way that they're designed, they warp, bend, crack, delaminate, and the process of making these highly temporary consumables doesn't really sit with our Nordic view of clean, green, sustainable products. So we wanted to create something new, something different, and don't mind me saying, something better. We wanted to take what we learned from our previous board builds, flip it, and do it all over again. This is the Uitta Biocomsit skateboard. It might not look that different at the surface, but it's what's inside that counts. The board is made of a material called Caroline Natural Fiber Composite, which consists of wood fibers and polypropylene, which is the byproduct of the oil refinement process. And this combination makes the board both responsive and tough. Really tough. The strength of the board comes largely from its wood fiber density, which is greater than that found in actual trees themselves. And not only are they tough, but our boards endure water and moisture unlike traditional boards, and they're fully recyclable. The trees are responsibly sourced from Nordic areas where tree growth outweighs the rate of forestry. These trees are then processed in a closed cycle facility with zero waste, meaning that all the material used is reusable, and this factory is powered 100% by green reusable energy. No glue, or any other toxic substance for that matter, is used in building our boards. And Caroline itself is so pure that it's even used to make dishware, like this mug right here. The process of going into manufacturing, machining the molds from solid steel and ramping up production is an expensive one. That's why we need your help. With your backing, we can take skateboards to the next level. We can make boards last and reduce the impact that they have on the environment. As soon as we reach our goal, we're going straight into production. We'll ship the boards as soon as possible, so you can enjoy them this summer. We're really excited to be bringing this board to you, and we hope that you love it as much as we do. How much freedom can you fit in a bag? The freedom of knowledge? The freedom to share? Freedom to dream? Freedom of movement? Now it fits with Linky. Mobility is freedom. With Linky's strong patented folding mechanism, it's freedom in your bag. It's a last mile mobility solution that means no more traffic, no more bus timetables, no more pollution. Linky represents a new generation in electric mobility. With it, we want to improve the way we experience cities. The team behind Linky is a group of passionate travelers. Wherever we were in the world, we found ourselves wanting a mode of transportation that is eco-sustainable, easy to carry around, and really fun to ride. With technical engineering and sales backgrounds, we've studied last mile mobility and made Linky to fill a gap in that market, but also in our own lives. Nothing out there is truly portable, so that's why we made Linky to fit in a bag. One thing that distinguishes Link is the incredible pride we take in attention to detail. We have worked for two years to perfect the patented mechanical system that expands and contracts Linky. Based on our experience in automotive design, our structure uses highly resistant polymers and carbon fiber for a perfect balance between lightness and rigidity. Weighing just 4.9 kilos, it's really sturdy. We have put 160 kilos on it and we have ridden hundreds of kilometers. 
My experience in the electric car industry is the inspiration behind the electronics and the battery of Linky. We wanted to be able to bring Linky on an aeroplane, so we've chosen a fast charging, long life lithium ion battery that respects IATA regulation for air travel. Safety is our number one priority in designing Linky's powertrain and battery management solutions. We've optimized for power, performance, and weight. Linky charges to 85% of its capacity in just half an hour. With Linky, you can ride 15 kilometers, climb up 10% slopes, and reach up to 30 kilometers per hour. Link is made by hand by one person who follows the project from start to finish. We are ready to go into production, but we need a minimum number of orders to make this possible. Your support right now will help keep costs down so we can guarantee a great level of service and a truly exciting electric longboard. This is the lightest electric skateboard in the world, Starry. You can use it as transportation. Bring it along onto subways, buses, or even car trunks to a further distance. You can ride it to get breakfast or grocery a few blocks away. Never need to worry about parking or locking when entering a restaurant with your board. In fact, you can bring it to anywhere. I have played all brands of electric skateboard. They are heavy, clumsy, almost losing the real form of skateboarding. What we want is a revolution of electro skateboards. So we smash control boxes, threw batteries away, pull bells out, discard old motors, and redesign a brand new ultralight electric skateboard, which is starry. To achieve the seeming impossible task, we had to redesign the motor to head it inside the wheels, as well as putting gearbox and sensor inside. We've designed many versions of remote control only for a better user experience. Instead of the short-lived belt, we use the planetary gears to provide unbelievably strong power. Starry has perfect power system to support high speed up to 20 miles per hour and going uphill on a 30 degree slope. With a small remote in hand, anyone even with no experience can easily control the board using our braking and accelerating features. Starry is safe and smooth to ride for all users from beginners to experts. Our technical team has top talents in electric, mechanic, and software engineering. We want to change young people's way of transportation, and your support is essential for us. Thank you. The first time I brought out the Rover after finishing the design, I took it to my favorite skate spot. I just made this new board. It was ready to go. It was just me and it was, it was perfect. It felt like I was on top of the world, waiting to drop in. 121C Boards is a lot more than just a skateboard company. It's a prototype to solve an industry-wide problem, in fact, a global problem of carbon fiber waste disposal. We'd really like to thank those people that supported us with the first Kickstarter last summer, which allowed us to go a lot further, a lot quicker than we thought. 
During the production of the aileron, we noticed that we were still generating a small amount of scrap, and so we decided to put that material to good use. That's when I knew we had it. This was, this was the board we were about to start making. really began to see that we wanted to engineer a board that was totally different. It's a time-consuming process. We start with one iteration, go back, change it again. We wanted to make it sleek and stark. Kind of had it looking like a missile. It's got those sharp, angular features that make you think of an aggressive aircraft. But there's a lot of purpose behind that engineering. We knew we had to put a hole in the board because we wanted people to be able to lock it up. We wanted to have a shape that relayed and conveyed its origin as an aerospace product. We ended up sweeping that hole back and giving it a slight curve on one side and a hard angle on the other, turning it into more of an aerodynamic shape. It all starts with processing. We get the shipments of scraps of material and we cut it to length and width, then kit it, load it into the press, and then take it out to the water jet cutter. Each board that we make gets water jet cut to incredible tolerance. Within five thousandths of an inch, an 80,000 psi stream of water comes and blasts the material out of the way. And what you're left with is a perfectly cut, symmetrical skateboard. From the water jet cutting to the pressing to the trucks, we have carefully engineered every aspect of the board to give you the highest performance. We really focused on stability. The Rover's really the stablest small board on the market. The carbon fiber composite is huge. It allowed us to make the board smaller, thinner, lighter. We have a new tighter wheelbase. It gives you that great handling. It feels very nimble and light. This board represents the passion and innovation of 121C. It's light, it's smooth, it's unlike any other board. It's far higher quality material than you can get in any consumer product. When we finally finish our board, it's like emerging from a cave. It felt like I was on top of the world, and then I dropped in on it. It's a whole new way of approaching skate. For those of us that love the art of engineering, this is the board for us. After iteration and iteration, we're finally ready to bring what we brought to the Kickstarter last time, and we're really happy with how it turned out. I really want to thank everybody who supported us in that first Kickstarter effort. Uh, that was fantastic. You helped us build a production facility that lets us deliver boards on a daily basis to everybody that orders them, and is letting us bring out this exciting new product, the Rover, which is going to make carbon fiber affordable to all skaters.